Hi there. Today we're going to go through some easy riffs to play on the guitar in the key of A. Now I just want to give a bit of background. These riffs I learned over 25 years ago when I purchased a book and a cassette. I thought these were pretty cool riffs so I just thought I'd share them with you today so I don't claim any ownership on these riffs or any creativity on them. So hopefully you'll have fun. All right. For all these riffs we're going to go through, you're going to see the tablature on the screen. Recommend getting a little bit of overdrive or distortion in your tone. Just a little bit. All right. So we'll begin with um, riff number one. Okay, so riff number one is a series of double stops on the first and second strings on the fifth fret. Sounds like this. So it'll have two sets of threes and a single set of two. So it sounds like this, playing slow. Now it sounds kind of boring if you play it like that. So if you accent the first in each set of three and the first in the set of two, It'll give a bit more flavor to it. And that's riff number one. All right, riff number two is very similar to riff number one, but with the inclusion of a slide from the fourth fret. So played slow, it sounds like this. I guess everyone's a critic. All right, let's get, well, no catnip for you tonight. So let's continue. Rip, riff number two, similar to riff number one, but a slide from the fourth fret. So slowly it sounds like this. And again, if you want to accent the first in each series, it'll sound like this. That's riff number two. Riff number three is next. Very famous Chuck Berry style riff. We're going to bend on the seventh fret to make it sound like the ninth fret and then play the double stops on the first two strings. Follow the tab on the screen. So slowly it sounds like this. <laughs> So the first one is like a bend, and then the double stops. So put it together and you get this. And that's riff number three. Okay, let's start with riff number four, similar to riff number three, except that when playing the double stops, you don't play them together but you actually play them as the individual notes on the fifth fret. So putting that together and following the tab on the screen, it sounds like this. And up to speed, it sounds like this. riff number four. Okay, let's try riff number five. Oh, not a music lover. All right. Riff number five is a bit different. Follow the tab on the screen. Played slowly, it sounds like this. So I like to use my third and fourth fingers to do that, you know, seven and eight fret little double stop on the first two strings. And you can add a little bit of bends in the first one. So up to 
up to speed it sounds like this. And that's riff number five. All right, riff number six involves some more bends um, on the second and third strings at the seventh fret. I like to use my third and fourth ring to do that, fourth fingers to do that bend. So played slowly, it sounds like this, the whole riff. So you're bending the seventh fret section up to the eighth fret. Then releasing it to the seventh fret and doing the rest of the riff. Played up to speed, it sounds like this. And that's riff number six. Okay, let's do riff number seven. Riff number seven sounds like this played slowly. again for the first part is a slide to the eighth and ninth frets on the second and third strings so it's just slide so the first part play that 13 times lucky number and then the second part of the riff so up to speed, it sounds like this. That last part with the hammer on, I like to bar the fifth fret and do that lick. Once more time for riff seven. riff number seven. So let's see how these riffs sound with a backing track in A. Um, I won't necessarily play these riffs in order from one to seven, but it's more of an exercise to see how they can be applied in a situation. So let's get that backing track going. some riffs in A that you can use in a blues situation or rock situation transpose them up and down the fretboard to match any key so I hope this was fun and I hope my critic liked it until the next video keep rocking